from eye-popping colors to stunning motifs and patterns, African designers showed their latest work in London. This year we've got over 50 designers in our selection and we've got like seven different countries represented from all over Africa that are really bringing the colour, the brand of Africa to uh, this year at Freemasons Hall in London's Covent Garden. Many African designers are not shy about using their fashions to tell the stories of their tribes and cultures that influence their work, giving their clothing a unique identity. George Adesegun showed an intricate women's wear collection which draws on his Nigerian British heritage. My collection is actually evolution, primitivism, primitivism couture, which is um, more or less the aesthetics of African, my aesthetics and my heritage and all that. I'm trying to like, bring those elements into within you know, my work that says exactly who I am and all that because I'm British born but I was brought up in Nigeria. The Evolution Primitivism Collection prints inspiration comes from the Nsibidi African secret text featuring centuries-old symbols. Amid a rainbow of color, one designer's collection used just one color in the palette, gray, which also features clever reuse of materials. And what I do is I salvage denim from charity shops, secondhand shops, and then I patchwork it into interesting patterns and this collection is based on kente cloth from Ghana. An award-winning designer says she gets inspiration from collection of creative minds at the show. They inspire me when I see the different creative designs that they bring because it might be something that you didn't think of. Um, like Palladis brought fashion today and he's got the man in the leggings with the, with the skirt which are like trousers with the pleats which I've never seen that before but it's, it's, it's very inspiring. This is the seventh year for the Africa Fashion Week London. The event's founder says the African fashion industry is worth $31 billion. Mariama Diallo, VOA News.